John the Revelator, when he saw the throne of God, very close to the throne of God, he saw four special beings and he calls them in Revelation chapter 4 verse 7, four living creatures. The first living creature was like a lion, the second living creature like a calf, the third living creature like the face of a man and the fourth living creature like a flying eagle. In the Old Testament, Isaiah also saw the throne of God and he saw the special angels and Isaiah calls them seraphims. If we put them together, both these special angels, they worship God the same way. Revelation chapter 4 verse 8 says, they have six wings and full of eyes and they do not rest day or night saying, holy, 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 Lord God Almighty who was and is and is to come. Friends, who are these four living creatures? According to John the Revelator and Isaiah the prophet, these four living creatures are four special angels who are near the throne of God, who are carrying the throne of God. They are having six wings and they're full of eyes, which means eyes represent vigilance. Wow, we praise God because those four living creatures or four special angels are very friendly beings. Because in Revelation chapter 6 verse 1, when Jesus opened the first seal, the first living creature came to John and said, John, come and see. They are very friendly to John, which means they are very friendly to us. Actually, the throne of God is a very friendly place because of the 24 elders and the four living creatures and all the angels who are in heaven. One day, you and I will be standing before the throne of God on the sea of glass along with the redeemed. My friend, that day is coming very soon. We need to prepare for it. We need to prepare to meet our God. God bless you. Shall we pray? Heavenly Father, now we see through glass darkly. But one day, we will be seeing you face to face. Lord, we want to stand on the sea of glass before your throne. And we want to praise you along with those 24 elders, four living creatures, all the angels in heaven, along with all the redeemed of all ages. Until then, Lord, keep us faithful in Jesus' name.